I hope everyone is doing great. In this video tutorial, we are going to see how to download Sentinel-2 image from Copernicus Data Space Ecosystem. So type in Copernicus Data Space Ecosystem. Now search. You can see the first link dataspace.copernicus.eu. I'll be sharing this link in the description. Please use it. Now click on this link. At the top, you can find Copernicus browser. We will be getting these images, satellite images. So currently two options are available, login option and anonymously. So I am going to use login. If you don't have an account, you can register your account within 60 seconds. The uh, You have to confirm your uh, registration. Uh, link will be sent to your email ID after uh, registering yourself. And after that, you can directly use your accounts. Within 5 minutes, you can browse and start downloading the data. Now put your email id and password and hit the button login. This is the data search visualization and download page for uh, sentinel images. So in this side you can see visualize search options available and here you can see that this is the base map where you can search for your area of interest navigate in and around the area. So the first option will be searching your location. So you have to type the place name at the top so after typing in you can see some results has been come up so mine is uh, Vijayawada which is located in India so I'm going to choose that one and you must be sure where your location is so you can uh, use the uh, Google Maps simultaneously to check with your location so like this also you can use the Google Maps you can use and you can find your location much easily so you can see here this is my area of interest and uh, you can upload shape files for example after clicking over here you can see an uh, option for uploading files here you can upload your shape files, KML, GPX. So it should be in uh, Geographic Coordinate System WGS 1984, as you can see here. So if you if it is there in that reference system, you can upload this, and directly it will be shown in the map. Easily you can select the area. Otherwise, you can use this option. You can draw a rectangular by using mouse left click once I have placed them um, place one point over here you can uh, stretch it like this if you want to reduce or increase you can click on each of this corner and you can reduce accordingly like this you can reduce so I have chosen the area like this by drawing a rectangular okay now uh, you can see on the left hand side you can see the search option where we are going to select our sentinel2 image in search within data source you can find sentinel2 image here you can reduce the cloud coverage okay now we have chosen the sentinel2 image after that you can choose the time range so here by clicking on this date you can choose the year for example i need it for if i need it for 2018 i can choose 2018 and choose the month accordingly now in this case I am going to choose it for 2024 after choosing the, uh, uh, the uh, year and month we have to choose the date and till what date you you if you want you can select it so I am putting it today's date you can s filter by month also if you don't want the uh, January February month you can unselect it and hit the button search like this you can search once the search has been completed you can see here the images will be come out like this you can visualize those images by clicking visualize and you can see this is the satellite image in order to differentiate be uh, between base, ma base map and satellite imagery you can change the OSM by clicking here so I am going to choose OSM background data instead of Sentinel 2. 
now you can differentiate the image satellite image and the base map like this you can differentiate now this image is having cloud cover so let me go back to the search option and find some images which is having lesser cloud cover let us visualize this image so this is also is having cloud cover once again search option so you can see here the latest image will be at the top and uh, this is a uh, monsoon season for india so the cloud coverage will be more during this time so i am going to choose uh, april month's imagery and let us have a visualize of it so you can see here this is the april month image the lesser cloud coverage and you can also see some more options you can see false color composite ndvi so these are computer generated swir ndwi so you can after selecting the image so this image seems to be good okay so this is the image which i have chosen right No, 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 not this one. So it was in April month. Yeah, this is the image which we have selected. Yeah. So you can see here in the study area, cloud cover is very, very minimal. So I'm going to use this image. Search option, go down because the most recent image will be at the top. Okay. So now in order to download this image, you can see the option over here download products so hit on download product the image will be starting to download so you can see here it has been started let us wait so the download is being done you can see here 100 percentage let us wait so you can see at the top once it has been processed over here it will be downloaded quickly so the download has been done let us check it in the folder so this is the image which we have downloaded let us move it to new folder and extract the file from here so the image extraction has been done